Hi, my name is Dr. Michael Brisman. I am a neurosurgeon here at Neurological Surgery PC. I have been practicing neurosurgery here on Long Island for a little over 20 years now. I personally specialize in patients with trigeminal neuralgia, which is a type of severe facial pain, and also different types of brain tumors like meningiomas, acoustic neuromas, pituitary tumors, and I personally uh, try to offer the best possible care for patients with those diseases. Neurosurgery, like other forms of surgery, are definitely moving towards minimally invasive approaches. Uh, we're trying to deal with the same problems, but do them with lower risk maneuvers, smaller incisions, safer approaches, and often outpatient uh, techniques. I personally take advantage of these minimally invasive techniques dramatically in my practice. Many of my treatments, for example, are done with a super focused radiation technique called radiosurgery or gamma knife treatment, um, which is an outpatient treatment that is very low risk way of treating brain tumors, trigeminal neuralgia, and arteriovenous malformations of the brain. Uh, this technique is an enormous advance. I refer to it as bloodless brain surgery and what we are doing in the realm of brain and spine surgery moving towards minimally invasive has a dramatic improvement in the outcome for patients. I try to make myself accessible to everybody, patients, other doctors, 24-7. I think that accessibility is very important in getting optimal outcomes for the patients. People need to be able to talk to me whenever they want. I'm happy to give people my cell phone number, I want people to call me if there is any issue or concern because I'd rather deal with the problem at an early stage than waiting till it's more serious. My father is a neurosurgeon and this is really why I became a physician and a neurosurgeon. So in my household, we, when I was growing up, neurosurgery is all that was spoken of or it was a big topic that was spoken of and because my father always spoke highly of of his experience as a physician and as a neurosurgeon, he encouraged me to do the same thing. Now, I always kept my mind open to what might I choose to do? Would it be a career in medicine or would it be as a neurosurgeon? And each step of the way, I enjoyed very much what I was doing. And if I had to do it all over again, I would definitely do exactly what I'm doing. I love being a doctor, I love being a neurosurgeon, but definitely my inspiration was my father. I have been on Long Island for a little over 20 years, and as far as I'm concerned, this is my home, this is my community. We do everything we can to provide the best possible neurosurgical services for the people of Long Island. That having been said, there are many people from elsewhere in New York, other states, even other countries that do come to visit us, and we are a resource for them as well.